Today we will be testing the opening range breakout lines indicator. Before we do, if you have not watched the first videos on the channel and the videos after that, you need to go do that now. Here at the Academy of Forex, we are building the best trading system possible as a team. You can find a link down below to sign up for TradingView. If you use that link, you'll save a little bit of money on your account. You can also find a link below to join us on Discord. If you are interested in a full list of all the indicators and strategies that we have tested along with their win rates, you can sign up for our Patreon and you will receive a full list of all the indicators and strategies that we have tested. You can find a link to our Patreon down below in the description. We also have a Patreon-only exclusive Discord channel where we will give you a list of winning indicators, a list of winning strategies, post trade ideas, give advanced advice, and much more. So click the link below to join our Patreon. Alright, as I said today, we will be testing the opening range breakout lines indicator. Before we do though, I wanted to put the testing scoreboard up for everyone to see. So to date, we have tested a total of 97 different strategies with 28 of them being winners. The best ones so far were able to achieve an 84% win rate. We've also tested a total of 920 indicators with 383 of them being winners. The best ones so far were able to achieve a 100% win rate. Now you need to go back and watch those videos to understand the context of how they were able to achieve that. So go back and watch those videos and see what you can get out of those winning indicators. We've also retested in the advanced testing 107 of the winning indicators. 39 of them have been able to maintain the winning status, the best to a 76% win rate. Now, if you're interested in a full list of these indicators and strategies along with their win rates, we've compiled all that information into spreadsheets, which you will get when you become a patron of the channel. Keep in mind that we test most of these indicators and strategies on the Forex and crypto market, but they can be applied to just about any market and time frame universally. Okay, so today we are testing the opening range breakout lines indicator you can see it on screen so i thought we would do something just a little bit different and break from the norm after uh over what three years of testing now um i think we are going to test this one on a lower time frame and only because the indicator itself um only works on the lower time frame because it is a opening range breakout indicator um, you don't really get that on the higher time frame because uh, you are basically um, dealing with just you know a daily candle instead of being able to uh, break down into a lower candle and so if we went into the higher time frame like so you can see that it doesn't display anything for this indicator. And again, that's because uh, it just doesn't function the same way. And so again, broke this down into a 15 minute chart. And we're gonna scroll back here where we were. And we were on this one right here. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna test this uh, for just one month of testing. And so we're basically going to test it for the entire month of June. And the setup on this is when we get a sell tag and a sell arrow, we are going to go short. When we get a buy tag, buy arrow, we are going to go long. We did adjust the take profit and stop. So basically I just cut the take profit and stop in half. And so that's the setup we're looking for. Let's go ahead and get off the testing and see what we can get out of it. All right, the first signal that we pick up is a long signal. You can see we get that buy tag right here and a nice push to the upside gets us to our take profit. Let's go ahead and continue on.
All right, we then pick up another buy tag right here. Make a push to the upside here on this really long wick. Got close to our take profit, but not quite before it then rolls over and makes the push to the downside here. We then pick up a short right here on this one. Let's go ahead and measure that out. And we do get to our take profit on that one. So what I'm gonna do is just go ahead and fast forward through the rest of the month testing, and then we'll pick it up on the other side to take a look at what it was able to achieve. All right, so that puts us at the end of the testing right there. Before we take a look at what this was able to achieve, if you are looking for a profitable trading strategy, I highly suggest you check out the best strategy that we have tested on the channel here. It was able to achieve an 84% win rate. I'll put a screenshot up of the thumbnail to that video right now. I'll link to it up in the corner and I'll also link to it at the end of this video with that same thumbnail. Like I said, it is a highly profitable trading strategy, was able to achieve an 84% win rate. It uses one of our custom indicators that we've developed here on the channel, as well as a trading view indicator. And all around, it is a wonderful trading strategy. I highly recommend you check that out. And so there is a lot of benefits to becoming a patron of the channel. I highly recommend it. All right, so that took a bit longer than I expected. Of course, this is the first time that we've tested an indicator like this. Um, as far as an official testing and not like uh, um, strategy type test and so nonetheless uh, like I said it took a little bit longer than I expected so I went ahead and just counted these out already so that way I didn't have to go back and count so many of the different trades and so uh, this did 37 trades within the one month of testing it had 18 winning trades and 19 losing trades and so that's going to put us right at a better 50 percent win rate right in, right in that area and so um obviously that's not going to meet the 60 percent criteria that we would typically go for and with the stop and take profit that we had set it's definitely not going to be profitable um i'd be interested to play around with this a little bit more and see if uh, maybe there was some correlation with um the other range um, areas the other range lines as far as maybe being a uh, area for take profit and um, some kind of a different stop maybe it just seemed like often uh, what we were getting was areas where price would come down and it would smack into the midline right here this black line you can see right here we get this sell uh, signal right here and price comes down smacks right into where this midline was from the day before and so that would have been a nice area for a take profit uh, to have set right there and then you can see it does almost an, an identical thing right here you can see that we get this uh, sell signal right here and it comes up and almost smacks into that midline really close into it but it does pull back and then comes back and you can see that it hits it right here and it's already starting to wick down right there and so uh, it seemed like that was a decent place to maybe put a um, take profit instead of just doing a flat take profit and stop like we did and so um, I think this indicator would be fun to play around with a little bit more and just kind of test some of the different ideas some of the different areas and so on uh, but uh, I don't know if we're going to necessarily put this yeah I guess we'll go ahead and put this on the scoreboard the testing list and I'll just notate that we tested it on a lower time frame because that's all we could do with the type of indicator that it is. And so it is going to go on the no list and we'll move on to the next video from here.
Thank you.